Hello, 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 and welcome back to the crew. Last episode, we got a bit sidetracked, so we didn't really do what we were supposed to. That's kind of a normal theme throughout school. Anyway. Um. Yeah, so th this can go away. I think F3 makes that box thing go away. I think I keep forgetting to minimize that. Yeah, so I need to do this. I'll just fast travel there. Maybe. Any minute now. Okay, and here we are. And here we go. We do something in the Touareg. That's our only dirt vehicle so far. Oh no, we're going to take money from the guy we don't like. Because, I don't know, why are we going after this guy again? This is a problem with splitting seasons up. I, I don't even remember... Why we're going after this guy or why it matters. All I know is that there's a Mustang truck. Are we going to drive the Mustang truck? Is the game's going to call it? It's not really a truck. It's more like an off-road Mustang. But still. This thing just looks awesome. I never really cared for the newest model Mustang because it looks too much like a Euro car, but. I mean, it's just too understated, but. Here, this thing just looks sweet. I guess the Mustang is not really that understated because it only has a 5 liter, but still. Yeah, it's a 5 liter, but it's a quad cam. So, yeah. Super hard to work on, but. You know, they mostly just sell these to people that. to old people that. See, they're young people that crash them and don't do any tuning on them whatsoever. They're old people that just leave them to sit in the garage for eternity. But then get inherited by young people that crash them or abuse the crap out of them, one of the two. Without really adding much to them. And that's how the life of a modern sports car usually goes. So uh, we're just running over the crates, because that's a thing. And this is timed, apparently. Got to destroy 80 out of 100 crates. So this is basically a scramble mission. Except bigger. And with the Mustang instead of whatever car we just happened to drag over here. The heck is going on over here? Yeah, I'm probably going to fail this the first time. Move, car. Yeah, definitely going to fail this the first time. Might have found one of the more difficult missions in the game.
Um, you know, it's been a while since I've seen a challenge here. I mean, yeah, I've lost some races before, and I've lost some of the side challenges, but... Oh, no, most of the races I lost because I screwed up in a really bad place. And why did I return to free day? Okay, uh, go solo. Come on. Can I skip this cutscene again? No, I cannot. Great. Also, why is this classified as a dirt mission when I'm using a rally car, a raid car? I mean, in fact, I'm not even using my own car, so what doesn't matter what car I bring here. I could bring a scooter, and it wouldn't matter. That'd be hilarious. <laughs> Getting a huge, massive cop chase at the scooter. Get it up to level 999, go like 300 mile per hour. <laughs> It'd be hilarious. Okay, so these first ones are easy because they're all pretty much in a line. Miss that one. That's alright. Um, go around the wind turbine. Here we go around the wind turbine, destroying somebody's crates. And if we don't destroy them all, we'll still raise this insurance rates. That's the only thing I could rhyme, could not think of anything else. Now I'm really, really screwed, because nothing rhymes with else. That's the song of the day, unless I think of another one. I'm just going to go straight across and kill all of these. go over here. I guess they're still kind of in a line. I just didn't notice it the first time. Uh, go over here. Can't see. Good luck doing this in first person because I can't barely see anything. Third person. Reverse. Turn here. Go this way. That's a lot of them. Nitro. I was too off from getting the bronze. Dang, okay. Try that again. Do I have to watch the cutscene again? Now I can skip it this time. Okay, here we go. That was hard. The terrain kind of screwed me over. 
We missed that one too. Nitrous for just a little tiny bit. And more nitrous. Around the mulberry bush. Which is not actually a mulberry bush. Get completely freaking lost. You can't see where I'm going. Panic because there's only 30 seconds left and I'm probably going to fail this again. Uh, no, I'm not. Yeah. So it doesn't let me destroy any more than 80, that's weird. I mean, you still got parts for the Torek. Okay. Give the Mustang back to wherever it goes. There's a train. Gonna blast across the train tracks. And ha ha ha, we destroyed all their income. Now they're gonna starve to death. Who's that guy? Doing too bad at this one. Just barely got silver. Okay. Okay, now what is there to do? Yeah, 
Yeah, it's one of the monster truck things. Okay, so this is the next mission. We'll just fast travel there, because I'm sure you just like to hear me rant while I'm trying to go places. You know, I gotta take this guy out, apparently. And I got interrupted again. Oh well. I gotta take this guy down. How am I gonna do that? Are you supposed to ram him to death again? A nice looking neighborhood here. Now we're in a cemetery. It's a nice neighborhood if you're a ghost. That was a freakishly big cemetery, too. Yeah, a cemetery on both sides of the street. You're in some kind of Mercedes? Is that a Miata? I can't tell. Two minutes left to take this guy down. Probably just gonna take myself down. Yeah, I'm pretty good at taking myself down. Come on, faster. I can't get an attack on this guy. You go, keep running in the wrong lane. Oh, you son of a! Are you supposed to be able to do this in a 350 level car? Oh crap. There, I, I, I pinched him. Yep, you see, you see that? You see that nice roof there? That means he's dead. Yeah, I deserve the bronze on that. I was terrible. Absolutely terrible. Breaking bonus.
Okay, so now we're apparently working for Colonel Sanders. He wants to take this cam guy out. Who I think murdered this other guy's girlfriend or something. It was the other guy that was working for us again? I don't know. I think he shows up a few episodes back. Anyway, uh, that's it for that monologue. Um, I'm back after a short break. This is still episode 15, but um, we got a satellite on the map. And, um, yeah, so I'm going to do one more mission, and then that'll be it for this episode. So we're in uh, New Orleans right now. Miami is huge. Like, you look at Miami, and then you look at Dallas, and it's like, Miami is like three times the size of Dallas in this game. Even more than that, it's more like six times. Okay, so uh, where is the next mission? You know, they had to abbreviate the map a little bit. I mean, the entire state of Kansas just gets turned into a sunflower field, so... Yeah. Other places had it worse. Montana, of course, of course, Montana isn't even. You got Yosemite Park, like, isn't it really supposed to be like up in this area, not like right where Montana should be? Um, anyway, is it Yosemite or Yellowstone? It's Yellowstone. He's Is Yosemite a place too? I think they're both national parks. I don't know. Do not live on the east coast. I mean west coast. Geez, now I can't even get the directions right. Yay for me. Anyway. Um, so that's the thing I got to do with the performance car. Is that another time trial? Probably. So I'll set waypoint there and then I will fast travel to like here. Because that's as close as I can get to it. And this is a mission I have to do with the skyline. Which I'll just switch to that automatically, so there's no point in switching into it yet. Besides, maybe it's slightly faster because it's a performance class car. Oops. I just kicked the Taurus show off the road. And then ran straight into a guardrail. I'm the best driver ever. I mean, you cannot deny that I am the best driver ever. And look at look at these car corners. Look, look at this corner. Look at this. Look, see? See? See, right into the water. You know why? Because I needed to wash my car. It was dirty because it touched all those cars of inferior drivers. They shouldn't even be on the road. They're awful. They're terrible. I don't even want to... You know what I am going on another rant again. It's not really a rant, but whatever. It's mostly just a really long running joke. But so... It's not really a running joke. <laughs> I don't, it's just kind of a thing. I don't know. Well, it's definitely a thing. I, I know that much. I guarantee you it's a thing. 
I'm, I'm not exactly sure what kind of thing it's supposed to be, but I am 100% sure it is definitely a thing. Ooh, car part. Gotta get a car part for my car's heart. Or it will fail, and then I won't have a car anymore. I'll have to take a bus to work, and the bus is full of smelly jerks, because they aren't very nice. I know them all from high school. And trust me, even though that sounds cool, it's actually kind of lame. Because all those jerks know my name, and they won't leave me alone. And it's kind of annoying, and they keep calling me out, and I just want to be left alone. I don't even know what I'm singing about. I think it has something to do with the bus. But that's okay, because I'm just trying kill some time while I'm driving around over the ground looking for a part of a car improvising is hard oh my gosh word There it is. Hiding in the bushes. Waiting to strike. With a smoke attack. Why do you think it's the dumbest thing I said in this entire video? <laughs> yeah, that, that's got to be like the hardest question in the world. Anyway. Um... Got some lag. PC does not like all those raindrops on the windshield. I like how we're just going mudding in a Challenger. That's totally what it was built for. <laughs> it's like Grand Theft Auto where pretty much every car is good off-road, so what good are off-roaders? But yet they keep giving new ones. Who knows? So, Skyline versus Lamborghini, and a really cool looking Charger. It's like a supercharger with like a carbureted, no, it's a charger with a carbureted supercharger sticking out of the hood. Is that even possible? Yeah, it has a V8, but it's not carbureted. It's a fuel injected 392. Jeez. Remember what I said about being the best driver in the world? Yeah, you can really see it now, can't you? Getting some lag. Ow. Oh. Sorry, Skyline.
Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Here we go. Gonna be uh, kind of a twat anyway. Right now we're in first. Oops. And that's victory for us. Unless you wanted to see me lose, I'm not sure why you would. If you wanted me to lose, you're just not a very nice person. So I gotta say. Ooh, I got silver. That's rare. All right. And with that, I'm going to end this episode here. Since I am starting to have some lag issues. Actually, I'll just wait till after the cutscene. Are we going to get a phone call? Okay, well, um, I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you for watching. Be sure to like, comment, or subscribe, and click the bell notification icon. Do any combination of those things that you want to do. I'm not I'm not gonna force you to do anything, that would be weird. Actually I can't really force you to do anything because that'd be even weirder. I can't, I can't just stick my hand through the screen and force you to subscribe and comment and stuff, but you know. Um what's going on? Oh that's just like a screensaver thing. Okay. Anyway, uh Yeah, thank you for watching. Do any of those four thingies. Uh See you next time. This is Strike9716, signing off for now.